Welcome to the library. I'm Michelle Hicks with the Pine Tree Garden Club and today I'm going to be reading Regina is not a little dinosaur and I'm reading this permission of Schwartz and Wade books and it's written by Andrea Zool. Okay, go ahead. Regina is not a little dinosaur by Andrea Zool. Deep in the primeval forest lurks a dangerous predator. Her name is Regina. At the moment, Regina is pretty upset. Sorry, Regina, this is a real hunt. It's not for small dinosaurs. Stay in the nest and be Mama's good little carnivore. Mama's good little carnivore? Ha! Huh? Regina isn't even that little. She knows she is ready. Roar! Regina already has a terrifying roar and a fear-inducing stare and an uncanny gift for camouflage. So after making sure her mom is well out of sight, Regina heads off for her first real hunt all by herself. Roar! It isn't long before Regina spots something in the undergrowth. Ooh, she creeps very carefully, snap, and quietly. Almost there, chomp. Ouch! Whoa, that could have been dangerous, and a snack that size would have totally ruined her appetite for dinner. Regina is going to have to be much more careful. Oh, sorry about that. So she waits and waits, and she catches a scent. Oh, yeah, that's more like it. She jumps on. Whoa, 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 careful. How do you get into this thing? Sorry, kid. That's just not going to work. Honey is turning out to be harder than Regina thought. Regina is worried. Why isn't she any good at it? What if she never gets good at it? What if she has to live the rest of her life as an herbivore? What if snap? Wait a minute, this might work. This creature is snack size and doesn't even have a hard shell. Roar! Yes! Yikes! This snack is hungry. Oh, I'm not that tasty. Regina decides to give her hunting skills one last try. Oh no, the mama! Roar! Regina! <gasps> Hi, mom. Mom is a bit angry, but she forgives Regina. And since Regina is so eager, Mom agrees to make her a list of things that are safe to hunt, and Regina promises to follow it. And she does. Roar, roar at the worm, roar at the bumblebee. <gasps> Bzzz, Mom! This book is dedicated to kids who are not too little to achieve their goals. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you had a great time. Don't forget to register today for the summer reading program. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.